trusty uh, Mitsubishi L200 animal. This morning, blooming cold. I'll come in here because it's a bit quieter. Blooming cold this morning, and I was getting absolutely no action whatsoever off the blower. So I have been right through this thing. One of the first things I did, oh, by the way, all of the blower, the resistor, are located underneath the passenger side of the dash. So you undo nuts at the bottom, four screws on the top, and then the whole glove box comes out, gives you really good access to the thing. Dead easy. The blower motor goes here, um, and that's the resistor, that little bastard there. So basically, this 12 volt feed goes to the motor, and then it earths through the resistor and back to the switch up here. There's a relay and a fuse, which is underneath the driver's side over there. So I checked all of those first of all, we're getting good supply. I checked the supply here, we're getting a good supply. It's not high resistance. Could I get it working? So then I took the motor out. I bench tested it across a, um, across a battery. Worked beautifully, no problems at all. So then, let me just, if I get enough power out of this thing, let me balance you there. When I connect up the blower motor, ignition is on at the moment, but the switch is off. Connect up the blower motor, operate the switch. The switch is off slow at the moment. And then the fan starts working. But if I stop the fan, it doesn't start working again. If I give the fan a nudge, fucking thing starts working bust of fan so don't automatically assume that because the fan is working it's a good one okay I'm not gonna run it long because obviously there's no uh, temperature going across there's no air going across the back of the resistor so the problem here I'm fairly sure now is the fan I'm just gonna go and bench test this and see if I can work out um, why that's gone high resistance, uh, but I'm suspecting that it's gonna be a sealed unit that can't be fixed. So I'm gonna find another one. There you go.